And it's not just families in that one in Overland Park. There are also two fires in Olathe. Stephanie Kayser is live at 165th in Warwick. Stephanie, the sound is actually what alerted them that something was wrong. That's right, Gina. They actually heard the sound of lightning or what they think is lightning that hit the house. And that's why everybody woke up and was able to get out safely. Now, it was actually the daughter of the family of three that was awake at the time who heard that and was able to alert everybody. Now, can't see a whole lot of damage from the outside of the home right now, but that's because it's all towards the back and the roof. But the damage is so significant that they weren't able to get back inside uh, this morning. Now, we're at 165th and Warwick in South Olathe. And this is what the scene looked like just a few hours ago. Again, three people were home and it was the daughter again that woke everybody up. And then once they were up, they smelled smoke coming from the attic. So got out of the house, grabbed their dog and called 911. They're currently staying at a relatives this morning. So good news is they did have family in the area. Now the same goes for a fire across town. This one was at 108th. Again, firefighters believe lightning could be the cause of it. Only one person was home, but they were able to go back and side and sleep there because the damage there wasn't as significant. Now, again, once the sun comes out, firefighters will go to the scenes again just to do their investigating and make sure that was lightning. In fact, that did cause these fires here overnight. We're live in Olathe, Stephanie Kayser, KCTV 5 News.